We're talking about the tropics. I know I want to talk about the fall weather as long as possible, but there are two tropical waves that we're watching uh, getting into or already in the Caribbean Sea. The one in red now has a little higher chance for development that is looking more likely by this weekend. It could somewhere in this general area become possibly a tropical depression or tropical storm gamma. And there's another wave that we've been pointing out all evening a little farther outside the Caribbean Sea. That one will likely follow with a very similar trajectory into the Western Caribbean. But here's the thing with these fronts crossing the Gulf Coast, they might block that moisture and protect the Gulf Coast. Certainly for this one, it looks like that will be the case and we will see about this second one, whether it will be the case or not. But just to give you an outlook, this is not set in stone. This is just one model, the European model. But notice we're going all the way to next Saturday and nothing's coming into this part of the Gulf Coast. That's because of the high pressure building in behind these fronts, just kind of blocking and keeping this area off limits. Although there may be some activity eventually in the Bay of Campeche and maybe over here with that wave that's farther out in the Western Caribbean by that time. Certainly we'll be watching really closely, but in the meantime, I get to show you this gorgeous seven day forecast with sunshine graphics just stretching on and on. Really fun to put all those yellow suns in all the way to the middle of next week. Cool mornings, pleasant afternoons. I really hope you enjoy it.